All right, so in this sort, it's um, looking at prefixes, specifically the prefixes in, un, dis, and miss. And a prefix is a word that goes to the beginning of a word to change the meaning. Specifically, it usually goes in front of a base word. And so then a base word is the actual, like, root word, um, is the word that prefixes and suffixes get added to. So in this case, we're looking at, like, the prefix, let's say un, and then you have the word uneasy. So you see the prefix un there. Let me zoom in and look at that word. You see the prefix on, and then you see easy. So easy is the base word, on is the prefix. What you, what you want to do is just sort these words into where they go based on the prefix. So is it like insincere going into the in column? Or is it dishonest going into the dis column? Or misspell going into the mis column? Note misspell. This is commonly misspelled because people don't put one S in it. But if you think the prefix miss has an S and then the word spell has an S, you need two S's there in miss spell. Um, so go ahead and you can go ahead and look at these words. I'll read them to you and then just sort them into the columns in, un, dis, and miss. So you have uneasy, insincere, dishonest, misspell, unaware, informal, unknown, misfortune, disbelief, infrequent, disorder, mistake, Disconnect, inhuman, undress, misleading, unfasten, inexpensive, untidy, mischief, disease, insane, disrespect, and discourage. Um, I recommend pausing the video, sorting the words, and then hit play again as we go forward and check the work. So go ahead, pause the video. All right, you've hit play now. Now we're going to look here. This is kind of what your column should look like across the board. Um, and zoom out some there. There we go. You can see all four of them there. It's, there we go. Okay. So when you're looking at these, um, there's a few things I want to point out within each of these columns that generally you think about like what all these in words mean and un and dis and miss. And you'll notice that these prefixes kind of have similar meanings, like they're like the opposite of, um, but they don't always necessarily mean that, like literally, like disease. It's not the opposite of ease. But, like, ease means something's easy, and then so dis would be the opposite of easy, and I guess a disease would not be an easy thing, so kind of there. Whereas disrespect, respect, the opposite of respect, disrespect. Ah, that's what the prefix does to it. Okay. Um, or even ones like mistake. So misspell is the opposite of spell. If you spell it, you got it. If you misspell it, it's not spelled right. But mistake, hmm, miss and take. I guess if you, like, take in, like, information, but then if you take it in wrong, you might make a mistake, something like that. So just an interesting, like, observation that some of them don't quite literally mean the opposite of something, um, but they do. Generally, these are just kind of negative, um, the, the wrong way type prefixes. The prefix all different, similar meanings in that sense. Here are your columns that you should have the word sorted into.